answer. Get off the building, you fucking fake piece of shit. Yes. The fake fucker is fucking dead. Put your hands up, you're under arrest for killing somebody. God damn it, not again. I will sing a song here. When I was four my mom said I narrowly sec death banged my head off the wall and then my brain was reset I do strange things like painting my forearm even my mom thinks I'm a total moron. Talented. You are a talented kid. Fans. Oh 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 you are grounded. Come home, Mr. Badger. You were meant to be an but I created you wrong. Don't sing in public again. Oh, 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 you are grounded, grounded. Good morning, class. Let's start day off by take attendance. Cody. Here. Daisy. I am here, Mrs. Carol. Rosie. I'm right here, Mrs. Carol. Elmo. Elmo's here. Zoe. I'm here. Rosita. Right here, Mrs. Carol. Baby Bear. Here. Max. Absent. Max. You are not absent, you're present. Oh, I'm sorry, present. Thank you for the apology, and poo. What do you want? <coughs> poo, how dare you call me the N-word? You know that word, it's racist towards African Americans. But Mrs. Carroll, it's what you are, eh? <coughs> poo, stop using that word. You are offending Elmo and Baby Bear. And you are even offending me, Zoe, Rosie, Daisy, Cody, and even Max. Rosita, thank you for your help, but I'll handle this. Pooh, how dare you called me the N-word once again? That's it, go to the principal's office right now. Good morning, Pooh. What brings you here in my office today? I called Mrs. Carol the N-word while she was taking attendance. Pooh, you knows those kinds of words are not allowed in my school under any circle systems. Saying the word like the N-word is offensive towards African Americans, I'm even an African American myself, that's it, you're suspended for two weeks, go home right now, I am calling your parents about what you just said to Mrs. Carol, hello, it's this the parents of Pooh, great, this is Mrs. Clementine, the principal of Go City Academy, I'm calling because your son called his teacher the N-word, he is suspended from school. Will you guys please ground him, okay? That sounds great. I appreciated that. Bye. Poo, words can't even begin to describe how disappointed we are at you for calling your teacher the N-word and then got suspended from school and while your teacher was taking attendance. That's does it, Poo. You are grounded, 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 grounded for a month. Go to your room right now and think about what you just said to your teacher. Wa 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 Man, we can't believe our abusive parents won't take us to school, and they won't let us use our rocket ship either, so now we have to take the bus there instead. I know how you feel, Annie. I can't believe it either. Me neither. But it looks like the bus is here. It's time to get on.
Oh no, it's our four least favorite troublemakers, hey. Don't talk to us like that. Too bad for you you idiot. Quincy, you better watch your mouth. No, I will not. Instead, how would you like to hear me and my friends sing my song? Oh wait, you don't really have a choice. <sighs> what? Why are we stopping at McDonald's? Kids, the reason why I stopped at McDonald's is because I need to use the men's room, so please stay seated and don't do anything bad. Okay. The bus driver is using the bathroom. Let's hijack the bus. What a super smart idea, Annie. Let's do it. Come on boys. Uh oh. Did I just hear the big iron stupids are going to hijack the school bus? Yes they are. Guys, I got so scared that I decided to switch seats. You guys might want to do that. The little Einsteins were sitting there. I'm following face look. I want to be safe. Me too. Me three. I think I'd better be safe too. Twelve seconds later. Hey, where's my bus go? Wait a minute. I saw four kids heading to my bus. They look a lot like the little Einsteins. I'm calling 911. Hello 911. Four little kids hijacked my bus and they might cause loads of haywire around town. Please come here as fast as you can. Thank you. Goodbye. This is Penelope Anderson, with breaking news. I'm standing by a Starbucks restaurant where a vehicle chase is happening. Four kids looking a lot like the little Einsteins have hijacked the school bus after the bus driver stopped at McDonald's to use the men's room. Many police cars and helicopters are coming after them. All the vehicles are coming right now. As you can see, this is a very serious case. There are a lot more police cars and helicopters on the way. Anyway, this is Penelope Anderson, over and out. Hey, give me back my boss. Later. We'll go on the record. Leo, Quincy, Annie and June, also known as the Little Einsteins, have done the following. Hijacked the school bus, drove at over 80 miles per hour, and crashed into a barn. What do the people have to say about this? Guilty. 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 Little Einsteins, because of all the crimes you committed, you have been sentenced to get grounded by your parents for an extremely long time. Case closed. When they got home. Leo, Quincy, Annie, and June. Do you realize you could have been in jail for life for all the crimes you committed? You know everyone won the bus was extremely close to getting severely injured. Why did you do this? Why? Why? Why why why? Because dad, we hate the fact that we had to take the bus to school. We hate it that makes lots of stops. It's more fun to look out the window and watch things moving. We're really sorry. Apology unacceptable. What can we and sorry do now? You four are so grounded for 18 quadrillion forevers. This will have consequences. No TV, no computers, no video games, no video chatting, no fast food, no entertainment, no candy, no dessert, no nothing. And also, one other thing. When you four go to your rooms, you four will absolutely never be able to leave your rooms under any circumstances. Have fun being grounded. God. We can't believe our abusive parents won't take us to school. And they won't let use our wi flyers either. So now we have to take the bus there instead. I know how you feel when you're red. I can't believe it either. Me neither. But it looks like the bus is here. It's time to get on the bus. Oh no. It's our least favorite troublemakers. Hey. Don't talk to us like that. Too bad for you four idiots. Alpha. Naughty boy. You better watch your mouth. No, I will not. Instead, how would you like to hear me and my friends sing my song? Oh wait, you don't really have a choice. What? Why are we stopping at McDonald's? Kids, the reason why I stopped at McDonald's is because I need to use the men's room. So please stay seated and don't do anything bad. 
Okay. The bus driver is using the bathroom. Let's hijack the bus. What a super smart idea, Wanda Red. Let's do it. Come on, boys. Uh-oh. Did I just hear the stupid readers are going to hijack the school bus? Yes, they are. Okay. I got so scared that I decided to switch seats. You guys might want to do that. The super readers were sitting there. I'm following Luke. I want to be safe. Me too. Me three. Me four. I think we better be safe as well, Jason. Hey, where's my bus go? Wait. I saw four kids heading to my box. They talk a lot like the super readers. I'm calling 911. Hello 911. There are four kids hijacked the bus and they might cause blow the pay wire around now. Please come here as fast as you can. Thank you. Goodbye. Stop right there! This is Mr. Just with breaking news. I'm standing by Starbucks restaurant where a vehicle chase is happening. Four kids looking a lot like the super readers have hijacked the school bus. After the bus driver stopped at McDonald's using the men's room. Many police cars and helicopters are coming after them. All the vehicles are coming right now. Stop breaking the law, asshole! Yoda! As you can see, this is a very serious case. There is a lot more police cars and helicopters on the way. Anyway, this is Mr. Josh. Over and out. Hey, give me back my bus. We'll go on the record. Super Y, Alpha Pick, Wonder Red, and Princess Presso, also known as the Super Readers, have done the following hijacking the school bus, drove over 80 miles per hour, and crashed into a barn. What other people have to say about this? Guilty. 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 Well, it's settled then. Super Readers. Because of all the crimes you committed, you have been sentenced to be grounded by your parents for an extremely long time. Case closed. Super Y. Alpha Pig. Wonder Red. And Princess Presto. Do you realize you could have been in jail for life for all the crimes you committed? You know everyone on the bus was extremely close to getting severely injured. Why did you do this? Why? Why? Why 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 why? Because dad, we hate the fact that we had to take the bus to school. We hate it. That makes lots of stops. It's more fun to look out the window and watch things moving. We're really sorry. Apology unacceptable. What can we and Sari do now is this. You four are so grounded 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 for 18 quadrillion forevers. This will have consequences. No TV. No computers. No video games. No video chatting. No fast food. No entertainment. No candy. No dessert. No nothing. And also, one other thing. When you four to your rooms, you four will absolutely never be able to leave your rooms under any circumstances. Have fun being grounded. So, kids, what are you going to order? I was thinking of getting classic broccoli chicken Alfredo. I'm thinking I will get a bacon ranch grilled chicken sandwich. And look, here comes the waitress. Have you all decided? Are you all ready to order? Yes we are, and I would like to go first. I would like to get a classic broccoli chicken Alfredo. I'm going to get a bacon ranch grilled chicken sandwich with a side of waffle fries. And for you, what would you like? 
I'll take the kids' cheeseburger, and I would like a coloring book and crayons while I'm waiting for the food. Excuse me, miss, but I think her oldest son is too old to order from the kids' menu, let alone color in a coloring book with crayons. He is 16 years old. Wait, I am not too old to order anything from any menu. Besides, I really miss coloring with crayons. I'll be right back with your orders, in 15 to 20 minutes, I have to wait another table. But I can be back in the next 5 minutes if you want to change an order. Alan, you do realize that no one your age draws in coloring books because those are for younger children, especially preschool and kindergarten age children. And you're also too old to order from the kids' menu. If you look at the menu, it says up to age 12. When the waitress comes back, you should order something from the regular menu. <laughs> now don't get me started with a tantrum, especially in a public place where everyone can see us. I just want to order kids cheeseburger and I also want a coloring book while we're waiting for the food. I just miss my childhood days. Don't you see? The kids' menu is only for ages 3 to 12, and you're 16. Why don't you order from the regular menu instead? You see, I don't draw with crayons anymore, let alone use kids' coloring books. And I am only 13 years old. Also, I had a feeling this was going to get really embarrassing. Alan, I think Tony has a point. Besides, you don't want to embarrass everyone in the restaurant with your tantrums, do you? I want a coloring book, 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 I want a coloring book. Why can't you let me draw in a coloring book with crayons? Alan. No! You're not getting a coloring book and that's final. It's fine that you miss your childhood days. That you need to realize that you're 16 years old, and you need to move on from those days. More importantly, you're embarrassing yourself, the entire family, and everyone in this restaurant. Now stop throwing your childish tantrums and get up off the floor. Don't call me childish, 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 don't call me childish. I'm 16 years old. I'm only upset that you don't want to get me a coloring book. Well, maybe if you stop throwing those tantrums, and at your age, I would not have to call you childish. Now get up off the floor and get back into your chair, unless you want us to get thrown out of the restaurant. Wow 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 Excuse me, are you all part of this boy's family? Yes, we are. This is my oldest son who is throwing a tantrum right now. I don't want to tell you this, but I have to. Because your son's behavior has been embarrassing for everyone in this restaurant. I'm going to have to ask you all to leave the premises. That's it, Alan, we're going straight home, and you're going to be sent to your room when we get home. Yeah. Boy, I will beat your ass! Man, I can't believe I got grounded. But I'm now ungrounded now, what will I do today? I will watch a new YouTube video. Lola new one by Jasper423, I'm gonna watch it. Jim Mullery, boy for 0042. How dare you talk smack at Chris, Danny, Jack and Kyle? That's it you're grounded for. 1-8-3-0-1-4-8-0-8-4-0-4-8-2-8-0-5-0-0-0-0-0-0-1-2-0-8-7-2-4-0-8-2-4-0-7-4-2-0-7-4-2-0-7-4-2-0-7-4-2-
I'm going on YouTube. Oh no, I got the first strike who did this. I knew it! It was Jimmy Larry Boy! That's the time calling the cuffs! And now that he got a strike, I will make a video called J. Oh no, it's the cops, they must have found out I gave Jasper a strike. Jimmy Larry Boy, I'm so angry about you giving me a strike so the cops from your Twitter said you hears what your father is going to say. Jimmy, how do you get Jasper a strike? You are grounded, grounded, grounded for 23, 14 years. So what he gave me a stupid message so I gave him a strike. He had that account saints last mouth and you gave him a strike when he gave you a message. How dare you? How dare I? Are you stupid? Because Chris is. Jimmy. You are just a idiot you just do this to us for no stupid reason and you talked smack at me and my three friends and now you're going to jail. That's right you idiot you hurt my friend like that exclamation point why do you have to do this? Because I'm a wiggly 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 lover. Jimmy, how dare you be a wiggly lover? That's so fucking it. I'm fucking fucking jetting you to jail. Right now you bitch. You can't get in here because my door is locked. Ha 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 ha. Well I have other fucking went into your fucking face so I can fucking send you to jail. I thought you were taking me to jail. I'm taking you to my boss's fucking office so he can tell you why you're captured. What do you want you your stupid period? You are in trouble for talking smack at four kids at a school. How the fuck you know? Well here's my point one. You talked smack. Two. You gave a weird gay dog a strike. And three. You are here. This is all you know. How can you not be sent to jail after what you did? Well because we wanted to capture you here to get your ass to make stupid stuff. Work here. What the hell do you mean by that? Do you mean? I have to work here forever. Unfortunately, yes. For how many days? Four zero zero one five seven one zero eight seven five one zero seven eight four zero eight seven five zero one eight seven two five zero eight seven five four one zero eight seven five eight zero one seven eight zero fifteen. Oh my god, no 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 Yes. No. Oh yes, yes, yes. No no no. Yes, 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 yes. No, I'm not staying here for 1351350981830 years. How can you stay here when you're not around? This is just STIBP. Well, if you want to leave, go ahead. Besides, I will follow you. Oh, no, you're not. <laughs> hey, brother and sister. What are you watching? We're watching American Dad. Popple. Oh, crap. What the? Hey, you turned it off. That's right. You two are too young to watch American Dad. That's it. What? Hey, you pushed it away. Correct. And guess what this means right now? Um, 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 um. You're gonna tell us we're grounded? That's exactly right. You are so grounded, 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 grounded until the 22nd century. And also, today is punishment day. First punishment, knocking the air out of you. 
No, 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 no. Ouch. That really hurt. It sure did. What I don't care. Second punishment, me and Mama putting nappies on you. Mama, please come here now. What is it, honey? Let's put nappies on brother and sister. I'll do it to brother. You do it to sister. Sure thing, honey. There. Your nappy is on. Now you'll go pee pees and poo poos in your nappy instead of the toilet. Third punishment. Watching Psycho. The 1998 version. No 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 no. This movie is extremely scary. Fourth punishment. Loud music. To the people watching this video. I suggest you turn down your speakers or headphones. Because it is about to get very very loud. Fifth punishment, taking a one negative thousand degree shower. Get in the shower right now. It's so cold, 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 it's so cold. Sixth punishment, throwing you up into the air three thousand feet. Now go to your room and never ever move an inch out of your room. Goodness, Joseph, what is the matter with you right now? I'm really scared of the thunder. It woke me up, and it's 2 in the morning. It was really scary, and I do not like thunderstorms, especially in the middle of the night. They are really scary. Oh for crying out loud, you're 11 years old, and kids your age aren't scared of thunderstorms. Now, go back to bed and stop acting like a baby. No, I will not go back to bed. I can't when there is a lot of thunder outside. Make it stop. 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 I don't like the thunder. Joseph, I'm serious. If you don't stop your childish tantrums and go back to bed, then you will be grounded even bigger time, and I will take away Coco Melon from you. I'm sorry. Mom, it's just that I'm really scared right now. Can't you please get me a teddy bear to protect me from the scary thunderstorm? Joseph, I am not in the mood. I am really getting tired of your childish behavior already. Besides, I think you're too old to have a teddy bear. Those are for preschool kids. Well then, can I have nightlight, so I can be protected from the scary thunderstorm? No! You don't need a nightlight anymore. 
you've been able to go without one before, and I think you're also too old for a night light. Besides, I think your friends will make fun of you if you have a night light. Now, I want you to go back to bed. I'll see you in the morning. Okay, Mom, I promise to behave myself and go back to bed. Wait a minute, I think the thunderstorm is over, I can finally go back to bed. Tomorrow is going to be a big day. The scary thunder is back, oh my goodness I am so scared, I want my teddy bear and my nightlight. Please, help me from the scary thunderstorm. Why does it have to rain right now? Why, this is getting even more scary. Help, help, someone please help me. This scary thunder won't go away. Someone, give me my teddy bear and my nightlight. Christopher Reed. After you promised not to act childish, you throw a really big temper tantrum. No, I want you to save me from the scary thunderstorm. Joseph, this is no reason to be screaming like a baby, especially in the middle of the night when we're trying to get some sleep. For this, you will be grounded for two months, and this means the beginning of the school year. During this time, no Coco Melon, no super simple songs, no wonder pets. And as a matter of fact, you will not be watching those shows anymore, because you're too old to watch those shows. Don't ground me, 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 don't ground me. And I especially don't want to be taking Coco Melon away from me. I like that show. Wow. Joseph, you're grounded, and that is final. Now go back to bed. Boy, I will beat your ass. Somebody please stop this scary thunderstorm. I better go hide in the closet. At least I am safe from the scary thunderstorm. No way it can get me in the closet. Hi H Master 32. Hi there wanna go to Cool Sarah's house? Yeah. No hi guys. Hi wanna go somewhere? Yo let's go watch that stage show. Okay. Okay everybody can come in. The host will come out in 10 minutes. Wonder what the show gonna be they didn't save. I know right what is the tea gonna be. Everybody shut up the stage is starting. <laughs> Hello's everyone for tonight show there will be one song and hear what IT is.
ITS wiggly 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 because the people WHO suck is H master 32 because he hates wiggles ITS a wiggly wiggly day oh yeah ITS a wiggly wiggly day oh ITS a wiggly wiggly day H master 32 needs to get out of Star Wars and Ninjago and be in 3 year OLD shows I hate those wiggles they show a stupid live show that shocked me and my friends well I have to find a way to destroy those wiggles well I can think later I need to get some sleep. Oh my god. It's jetting ready in 3, 2, 1, 0. Those wiggles are going down. I'm jetting weapons. Get out of my way, idiot. We could be related forever. Yeah, we should because H Master 32 sucks anyway, even Star Wars. Open the door, you wiggles, idiot. If that's H Master 32 D-O-N-T, let him come in. Open the door. What do you want from U.S.? The live show you screwed up because I want a day live show that's better than your stupid wiggly song. Like what? We must kill H Master 32. Rock songs sucks wiggly shows rock. No it's not. You are a HTE idiot, we fight before I go use my laser on you. Firing laser at H Master 32. Thanks for killing those wiggles IT, are white to not let them be in the stage but they wanted to thank you for destroying them. Yeah anyways I'm going to Andrew's house.